This is where the magic happens. I'm, I'm basically David Blaine over here. Yeah. Roaring Twenties Beauty is back with the modern twist. So we are turning to professional makeup artist Denise Black to help us travel back to the future through our face. <laughs> this is about me. My co-host, Hattie DeJamal! Woo! Oh, Woo! yeah, there it is. I love television. I've been drawn to it since I was a kid. I grew up watching Blue's Clues, and I'm gonna be honest, I know it's a preschool series, but I watched that show well into my teens. <sighs> the biggest part of it for me was to be able to tell a really good story. It can be a scary thought to take that leap to actually pursue your passion, but it's even scarier to think of not having the choice to, which is exactly what almost happened to Ashley Hanna. She's the founder of Titanium Yoga, and she's here to share her very inspiring story in her pursuit of her passion. I will never shy away from a dance battle. You can, you can bet on that. So Somebody wants to challenge me to a dance-off, sure. Hattie the host. Our girl's got some moves, Hattie, thank you. Get it, girl. We're gonna see Hattie and him dance off. Oh, I, this is happening. It seems everyone is making TikTok dances these days, including me. What? Right. What? what? Let's this go. This is happening. Here we about? go. We can... <laughs> We're gonna end the... Hey, hey. Hold on, hold on. All the way, all the way <laughs> today. <laughs> In the books. Oh. I've gone surfing, I've done salsa, I've went horseback riding. I've done way more things at work than I've ever done in actual life. And if you don't feel medieval enough yet, you'll reheat your piece regularly in what glass blowers call the glory hole. I feel like I'm in a different century right now. I'm going in. This isn't a method they teach in art school, but the true artists, they know about it. Give it a nice little dab. Off ball to spin backwards create lift and sustain flight. I think this is gonna require some practice. Art, that's art. Ready to fly on the water for the first time? Here we go, launch. Look at that. Holy crap! Don't worry, the controller comes with a fail safe that powers the board off if you fall, which I did, a lot. I did talk about my pun game, right? Because I could keep talking about it. It's solid. There are a lot of instruments you can learn out there, but the drums, they're a sound investment. Huh? If you ever gotten the dryer as a kid, yeah. it's the exact same thing. He tumbled into the job. Hey, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Man, you're, you're, you're right. on it today. I am on fire. This show takes a mini golf to a whole new level. And if you think the puns stop there, they don't. There's no such thing as a boring story. They're just boring storytellers. There's some scary stuff coming in 2019. And I'm talking about more than just that rainbow armpit hair trend. There's some scary, creepy, keep you up at night, make you check behind the shower curtains just in case horror flicks hitting theaters this year that you won't want to miss. Oh, games. Love games. Welcome, player one. You're now entering a live arcade game. I feel like I'm in the fifth element. Is Bruce Willis in here? So speaking of comedy, you oh guys got to be good at improv. We're going to do a quick... Oh Spitfire, boy. it's a game of things. You ready? We're yeah, gonna do this it's real called quick. The Game of Things. The game of That'll be on Netflix this weekend. <laughs> Next special. The Game of Things. Jacksonville edition. You're good. <laughs> this is unscripted, you guys. This is you should see the right teleprompters here. doing this. Huh? I feel like I was a game show host in another life. Okay, so I caught these two guys, and I think we should actually do this family feud style. What do you think? I'm ready. Absolutely. We surveyed 100 people, or in this case, two. two. What are your dating deal breakers? And go. Uh, uh, I think I saw it over here first. Can't be pregnant. Oh, good answer, good answer. Yeah, okay. <laughs> what you got over here? I'm gonna say not be married. Oh man, those, I think both of those are, survey says, I think those are both tied for first. Yeah, good job, guys. You are the weakest link. Goodbye. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> you are the weakest link. Goodbye. Wow, that hurt. D did it? It hurt. It hurt. It was cruel, and it delights me. It's really not safe to leave me in the kitchen. Why did you agree so much with that? Right, but you know what goes in barbecue sauce? Barbecue and sauce. Well, now that you got your shopping done, hopefully, or at least started on it for the holiday guests, it's time to meal prep, and uh, you don't want to spend the whole time in the kitchen. I know exactly. I don't. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Well, you never do anyway. I sure don't. A lot of the misconception is that uh, the job isn't really it's not really that demanding. It's just got to be all fun and games the whole time. I'm not going to lie, it is. It is a lot of fun and games sometimes. It is. Everyone, get to the chopper. You can do more than just blast away boredom when it comes to arcade games. 
Give me a reason to dress up in anything I'm in. Oh no! Hat! My hat's gone! <gasps> my hat's gone! Oh my god! Oh, oh, oh. Oh. I'm Hattie D. Jamal. Whereas you used to call me the cool guy. No one called him that. Pretty much everybody. It's time to party 80 style. Your queen today. I will not bend the knee. Yeah, well, you will bend the knee, Jon Snow. I will not. Yeah, <laughs> but you will. Halloween is all about scary encounters. And what's more scary than a family gathering? Not much if you've been to my house. Elsa! Yeah, kids is coming. We are to Jacksonville. It's the end of the road world, world tour. tour. April 12, 2019. That's right. Get your tickets. Friday, November 2nd. Hey, you're always messing Friday. up, cat man. I know. I just played the drum. <laughs> Guys, guys, you think they're gonna like this? I, I, I wouldn't do what I do if I didn't have an absolute blast every day. But it does get tough. You face things just as the world does, and you're at the forefront of national narratives most of the time. It just shows that a coach was successfully able to remove the gun from the student's hand. I think that seeing this just kind of shed a little light in the fact that, you know what? We might be overlooking a little bit about how we approach these type of situations, that maybe we could use a little more compassion in these type of situations. That's right. It's crazy, this job can really hold up a mirror to you. I found out about the Roar tryouts about a month before they were gonna start. And initially I just thought it was gonna be a fun idea to cover it. So it started off as a story, but then it became an experience. You really find out who you are when you get pressed up against all kinds of challenges, obstacles. Hattie D. Jamal here, and I'm here at Canines for Warriors, and this is a program that is vitally important to our vets. The one thing I've learned is that no matter what, being yourself is always the answer. I'm a star! Yes, and run again! That's really a rewarding part of my job. Leaving that mark and leaving my impact, no matter where I go, is really my biggest objective. I had some amazing amazing opportunities to do some really fun interviews. I met some really interesting characters. I'm really excited to see where the next chapter goes. Hey, I'm Hattie, and I'm your host. Okay, we're good, we're good. I think, I think we got it. Oh my, all right.